run. As we are getting ready for the finals of barrel race, let's talk about the top four, Fallon. The top four, we come in with uh, Jane Melby. She's top ten in the world. She's won Denver on this horse. This horse is Blackie. He's first down, dash, bread, and Jane knows what she's doing. She's a competitor, and she's always in person to be a contender in a shootout situation. She knows what she's doing. She's been hospitalized, so she's not at the top of her game, but I think she is rested enough to make this chance really, really count for her. As she approaches this first barrel, she's flying in. Runs it by, but this horse is really, really running. She's protecting herself with the second barrel. Going down to that second barrel, shoot his head a little bit, so I'm going to fall. I was afraid that I could get it out of my mouth soon enough. Oh, I just feel terrible for Jane. She really had a great run going with a 14 20. Oh, that's just a heartbreaker. And it's sick. Oh. She's already sick. And, oh, what could have been, perhaps, we'll, we'll know in a moment. Here's Robin Herring. Robin Herring could win a half a million dollars with this run. Here's our very first qualifying barrel racer taking a chance at being our first millionaire at getting her hand in that million dollar pot. She's running fire water on the rocks. He's not just a winner himself, he produces winners. And this is a pretty, pretty first barrel. It's not the fastest one she's had that we've seen her make. That second barrel was absolutely flawless. She's hustling. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh. <laughs>
Jackson, who is with a $100,000 barrel racer today, Lisa Lockhart. Amy, take it away. If there was anyone who would be better at making a clean run for $100,000, it would be Lisa Lockhart. You are always so consistent, and I know you probably wish Louis was up here with you because he's a big part of that, isn't he? Absolutely. You know, our horse is our soulmate and our teammate, and, you know, it, it's a team effort, and my family and my horse, I mean, you can't do it without so many people and so much behind you. Tell me exactly what this means to you. I can tell you're emotional about it. <laughs> um, it's, it's a life-changing experience. The only way it could be any better is if my family was here with me, which they're not, but they're there with me in, in body and mind and soul, and I know they're cheering at home right now, so anyway. And um, yeah, it's just a great thing, and it's amazing what they've accomplished putting this all together, and there's a lot of a lot of people behind what happened today. So thank you to all of you that made this all possible. What are your plans? Oh my gosh. Um, <laughs> well, I, uh, uh, you know, we, it's a very busy time of year right now. So um, I got a day off and then it's off to Houston. And, and um, anyway, you know, it's just one step at a time. And uh, that's just the way it is in this business. And, and you can't get ahead of yourself. What a huge accomplishment with the field of barrel racers that we had today to come out on top. Congratulations to you. Thank you very much. Congratulations. Thank you. Well, she's going to need some of that money to, to fix all the broken tables and furniture in the house because her family surely got something tore up celebrating by now. That's Richie Champion. That's what he found out. He's going to get the whole billion. We'll be back to ride some bulls.